Okay, so today we are going to do C is for compass. So if you look in your Google Drive, you will see the templates, or you can also go to allaboutlearningpress.com. They have them there as well. But, so for this one, I always use white as my background, so I think I'll have to make this part that's white. I might have to make it a little bit different color, um, but you could just use a different color for your background. But here it is. So, we would need um, the dial to be red, the base plate's going to be white, and then the C is going to be yellow, if you want to do it like this shows. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to cut out, this one looks like it's a little easier than some of the others, doesn't it? <laughs> we're going to cut out our letter C here. So for this, you would also need glue and scissors. I again put all mine on a, um, I usually put all mine on the white cardstock. So you can use a, um, you can use white construction paper. You can do it like they do here and use the different colors of construction paper. Um, I just usually use white because it makes it, I started that way and it kind of makes it easier. I want them to all look the same. <laughs> Then we're going to cut out our base plate here. In other words, it's just a big circle, wasn't it? Let's show you that top part. Then we're going to have our store. So we have C is for compass, compass, and a compass helps you tell direction. So you can have a compass rose, compass on a map, or you can have a compass if you're out, um, if you go hiking or something, maybe you go hiking with your parents or friends or something, and you um, you have used a compass before. Now I'm going to cut this out of the yellow. If you're making a lot of these like I am, I actually have a plastic container that I throw the big pieces of the color construction paper that I have left over in so that I don't have to keep um, digging around. That's why sometimes you'll see me kind of lean over to the side. It's because I am digging in my bucket. I don't want to have to try to, it's just too much trouble to try to put them back down in little construction paper thing each time. We have our letter C. Now we're going to need the background. And you can do it in white. Again, I think I'm going to use a different color for mine because I'm going to use, I have a white background. Okay, so I need to put my star here or my dial on red. And this is the part that points to show us north, east, and south, west.
And I'm not that good at drawing a big X, X star, however you would have this happens to look to you. Um, but you might be, so you might do this with, without having to um, have a template, because this one is a little easier than some of the others. And then now I need this piece, and I'm going to do mine on a light blue. I can see it, but it will stand out against my white background. I don't want it dark though, because you have to be able, you have to draw on it. You have to put north, you have to put your directions on it. So, let me cut it out. And if you or just kind of freehanding this. You could always take the bottom of something that's a circle to kind of make this part. Now let me get my white eye stop. I don't mind that okay. So, and these I think we were all kind of doing, it's kind of doing the little lowercase letter sideways. So it'll be like this. Like that. So we're going to put this here. Picture their dial is a little crooked, um, but I'm gonna put mine straight up now because I think um, that for some people that might be easier. Now let me see. I have to get my have some um, sharpies. I have a red sharpie. I do. Let's see. So now we're gonna write on it. I'm gonna write north. West, East, and South. And there we have our C is for compass. Hope you have a wonderful day. I'm supposed to move it up a little bit so you can see it better. There we go.